The Netgear Genie app enables users to easily connect and control their home network from a smartphone or tablet. With Netgear Genie, you can modify network settings, diagnose and repair network issues, monitor devices connected on your network, set up parental controls, and more. To begin, download the Network Genie app from the Apple App Store or from Google Play based on your device's operating system. Now that you've downloaded the Genie app, let's launch it to begin. The initial screen will enable you to either sign in or create a new account. We'll walk you through both. If you currently have a Netgear single sign-in account, you can skip this portion of the video. To create a new account, select the tab and then enter your name, email, and password, and agree to the terms. Click Next to receive an email verification for your account. Now please open up your email browser to verify your email. Now let's sign into your account. For your account login, please enter your email address and password registered under your Netgear account and sign in. Reminder that this is not the password for your network. However, next you'll enter the network password indicated on your Netgear router, or if you've changed the password, you can enter that now. You will now be taken to the main dashboard where you can access different Genie app features. Let's go through the features. Wi-Fi enables you to view and edit your network settings. Guest Wi-Fi. Here you can create a guest network for your visitors, view and edit settings. The network map. Here you can view all the devices connected to your router network. Parental control. Here you can set policies to keep your kids safe on the internet. Traffic meter. Monitor your network usage by day, by week, and by month. My Media. You can use the My Media feature on the Genie app to play media stored on computer and Wi-Fi devices that are connected to your Netgear router's network. ReadyShare. When you're locally connected to your router, you can use ReadyShare to access files that are stored on a USB device that is connected to your router. TurboTransfer. If at least two computers or devices are connected to your network, you can use the network map to copy files from one device to another. QR Scanner. The Genie app can generate a QR code of your router's Wi-Fi network and guest access. To use the QR scanner, your phone or tablet must include a camera. Remote Access. This allows you to use the Genie app to remotely manage your router. You have to enable the feature using the toggle presented on the page. And finally, the Reboot Router. This will enable you to reboot your router. Now let's take a look at the network card. Swipe the card up you'll see different networks presented while you swipe through different brands. You can see the list of devices connected to your network. If you choose to log out of the app, click Log Out on the network card. Once you log out, the dashboard features are limited to My Media, Turbo Transfer, and QR Scanner. Now let's move up to the right corner where you'll see a downward facing arrow. After selecting the arrow, you'll be able to select a different router for local or remote access. Finally, let's check out the menu located on the top left corner. Here you'll be able to change your password, contact support, learn more about your app and router, and sign out of your session. We hope that you enjoy the new Netgear Genie app.